Hello and welcome to Dwarven Fortress on Daily Fix. So today we're going to be continuing with our fortress. I'm probably going to get started digging this mode, so I feel a bit more defended. Also, we have 26 pops. So yeah, we probably should invest in getting... I don't know, like, like a bit of a, a group of fighters set up, especially... <laughs> After what happened with that poor, poor trade merchant from last episode. Let's go down before we do anything else. Let's check out what I was actually doing. Yeah, we are... This actually looks so much better. Look at this. They're placing in the beds. It sounds like they are extremely excited. This is going to be removed. I want to look into musical instruments as well. We also need to start placing some of these um, thrones, so let's just do that right away. Wow, one, huh? Oh, wait, no. <laughs> I'm an idiot. Uh, chairs over here, close material. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And this was going to be moved. All of this should be moved. That's fine. Now, uh, over time everything will go. We will have to do something about flooring. And we were digging downward. Man, I love that song. It's extremely loud. But, um, yeah, you, you guys have to suffer through it. Yes, you can do it. You can do it. It's so cheery. I, I was actually, for a second, I was like, oh, I might want to sing along. Uh, we also, let's zoom out a tiny bit. We're going to be designing or continuing our bedrooms over here. And I kind of want to do this over here as well. So I want to go into blueprint mode. And this is in the center of it. Uh, wow, that's that's completely, completely wrong. There you go. And how large is this? Well, it's fine. We'll just go over here. It's a free... We can always remove them. It's it's not that important. We know there is actually going to be these areas. So let's just make those in advance. Do this one as well because that's all the same. And then one over here. Um, is this one? Actually, let's just go this one. I think this is an e easier one to use, especially if you're just doing single blocks. You don't have to double click. Okay, and this is also going to be a free. So that is basically another corridor. So how are you guys doing, by the way? Also, thank you so much for the people who've been watching. And I have a question. If you are enjoying this, then would you please consider uh, leaving a like on the video, at least I know that you guys are still interested and you want to see more. Uh, lack of that eventually will most likely cause me to, uh, you know, rethink my strategy and I don't want that if people are actually interested in it. So this is um, a bit of a call to action because I'm, I'm not the person that wants to for a second now, I was talking like the mu the the music is just um, hanging. I don't want that. Uh, so I, I'm not the person that wants to add these call to action things. I think they're rather hideous. Uh, so yeah, let's just do this one. This should probably be enough beds. So this is all going to be mined out, and I want to do this before we go further into the um, the depths. To the depths and we'll do this bit later but this is uh, two four six eight that's nine that's uh, 18 and this one's empty it's 20 uh, we have plenty of beds over here um, we can actually just do this and yeah it's it's a lot of work but it's fine I really really want to get this stuff but uh, yeah that that's for future future things going on oh, how many miners do I have actually uh, let's just go to labor. He's also a professional professional miner. This one could mine. Let's put him on there as well. Do I have enough picks? 
That is a good question. How many picks do I have? Of 16 picks. So we have a lot. Look at this. Wait, do we got some... Oh, wow. Could we have... Where's my... Um, my information there? Well, it's fine. It's not over there anymore. What do we have? Pink Jade Cluster. Ooh, interesting. I kind of want to start mining those out, but... Oh, well. What can you do? Um, let's take a look. How much water is in here? Okay, so everything above two is not good for your dwarves. And you can see wherever this is going, the, the, all of this, the, the jumping of those lighter blue tiles, that is where the aquifer is actually doing its thing. Now, there is one thing that we could potentially do, and that is smooth. This wall. Can we do that over here? Oh no, it's, uh, it's, we can't do that. It's just regular, regular sand. Then I think this is as far as this is going. Let us just close the area down here. I will actually, I kind of want to forbid all of this. Um, it's over here actually. Let us forbid. Because I kind of don't want them to get themselves into a position where we will lose a dwarf. Like so. Now, everything should be forbidden. It's a shame. It is honestly a shame. This they can pick. Um, but I kind of hope that we can just do this wall. Um, select. It's a fray that goes down. And... Distance is one. I'm wondering which one they will take. Now, in the future, in the future, this we can always. Oh no. <laughs> You're bloody kidding me. Way to go, dwarf. Way to go. Who are you? Groff. Groff. What the hell are you thinking, man? That dumbass. Alright, so we can't do the one that's actually nearest. Oh, that is so dumb. <laughs> Alright, cool. Move. And uh, hopefully he will pick this rock and build it. And he will not be stuck. Okay. Before we um, tune up the water here, we need to be very, very sure. There is no one. in, And I don't think there actually is... Uh, where was this actually going? Don't remember. Where was that going again? It's this one. Never mind. Uh, this one we can actually remove. Um, uh, why am I dumb? Why am I dumb? There we go. And we'll do the same thing with this lever. And we will now go up. Uh, all the way over here. And uh, to the well. To the waterway. Pull the lever. High priority. And we'll see this open. There we go. So it will start filling in. And... We, they might, some of these rocks, they might eventually move. So together with the aquifer, this will actually go pretty, pretty fast. And this will all be filled up again. And we will have drainage. And I'm hoping that we can actually get it all the way over here to like 5. And we weren't able to do that, so that's why it actually took me so long to actually do. Uh, let's take a look. Farm sleeping areas is 4. They have been... Crazy. Damn, look at that. Alright, doors. Start with doors. So, actually, we'll do it differently. We have a good good amount of them. Doors. Just just use whatever. 
And I'm still thinking if we eventually want to put in like armor stands in them, or we will make um, dedicated uh, rooms for our military. Okay, furniture, beds. And we were doing bed at the end. And we'll do that over here as well. And that's it. We also want to do chests and cabinets. Because all of our dwarves, they do need rooms. How many do we have? Well, we have a lot of them. Damn. That is a serious amount. I'm very... Uh, did I change that? Yeah. Five of them. More than enough. More than enough. Drinks are doing perfectly. Seeds are going up. I want to see what seeds uh, are actually there. And it seems like we have another masterwork. We have a masterpiece iron breastplate. Oh, yeah. That sounds very good. Uh, let's go to furniture chests. Just filling these up. And hopefully by the time that they're done... Uh, can we make beds out of a different material? So far, I've not seen that. Make bed. Okay, that's just a no. So beds can only be done out of... Uh, out of wood. That is a bit unfortunate. Yeah, we need to destroy those dingoes. Look at this. I think one of the dingoes actually died. Yeah, this one is... No, this is the donkey. <laughs> Still, I think it's hilarious. Uh, that's all been completed... That's done. Let's go back to this area. Uh, it doesn't appear that we are smelting anymore. So we're going to do Magnite. And we're going to do this ore. Oh, it seems that we only had one piece. Or are they lacking something? We have coke. So we should have enough fuel. This is a fuel type. Uses as fuel in a smelter. Wait, in a smelter? This is a smelter, right? Yeah, this is just a smelter. It's fine. All of that is going to be done. We have some gems. Definitely not enough. Alright, that's all placed. Man, what a... Absolutely... It's so hideous when it's not cleaned. We do need some more beds. Let's see if they made those already. Two, three. No, only two of them. Uh, this means this is all done. So let's uh, let's zone that into bedrooms. Multiple. Done. That should make a lot of dwarves extremely happy. Okay, how is the water doing? It's going extremely nice. We saw actually see these rocks. They are being moved. This is almost free up. What we can actually do, if if all of these are like over here, because you can actually see this go down. Some people were wondering if you could actually drain water. Yes, yes you can. Okay, uh, let's pause for a second here. There's nine people that are sulking. It's raining. Uh, new rock doors and yeah, whatever. Let's go over here. Because I think all of the water should have been evaporated. Let's turn this off. It's annoying. Let's see if we still get aquifer. Alright, one, two. And no, it's, it's, it's actually a lot less than it was. Let's do it again. But we're not out of the blue yet. And let's go smoothing the walls. Like we did. Let's wait for that one. Okay, start smoothing that. Uh, while that's going on, everyone can actually smooth these. 
Now I will wait because I don't want to get them drowned. If we start mining down too deeply already, it could go very, very badly. And that's it. Go down. Now because there is water standing in these staircases, it's extremely likely that, well, they uh, there's actually them down here. Alright, that's all. I think this is the end. I think that is actually the end. This is two water spots because of the water down here. So I don't think this is like for unless. Well, we could give it a moment here. Let's do that again. Smoothing the walls. I don't see it go to like two. We could start mining into this uh, on this floor to the left. See if we can find something that's actually interesting enough to mine. And we'll start using the other mining function. Also, once this safe is done, I would like to try going over two of our dwarfs. Let's just go with name, please. So we have um, er Erosian. Erasian. Erasian. I'm, I will butcher everything in this name. I'm very, very sorry about that. Personality. Okay, so he has a great kinesthetic sense and a great affinity for language. <laughs> Make this the first dwarf you actually talk about daily. Do that. But he, is a, uh, he has large difficulties with willpower. He lives in a high energy kinetic pace. He often feels lustful. He can easily fall in love or develop positive sentiments. He has a noticeable lack of perseverance. Perseverance. He is somewhat quarrelsome and he has. And he is bothered by this since he valued friendship. He tends to form only teenagers emotional bonds with others he tends to be swayed by the emotions of others he is slow to anger he needs alcohol to get through the working day he likes working outdoors and grumbles only mildly at inclement weather so he could actually work outside pretty nicely uh, he likes others in his culture, he has a great deal of respect for the law, greatly prizes loyalty, seems friendship as one of the finer things in life. Believes that a ho uh, honesty is a high ideal, greatly respects artists and their works, really respects those uh, that take the time to master a skill, deeply respects those that work hard at their la uh, labors. Respects fair dealing and fair play, values corporations, finding merrymaking and partying worthwhile activities. So he loves to party. Cool. Values uh, martial prowess, values leisure time, respects commerce, values knowledge, and finds nature somewhat disturbing. Wow. Okay. His personality seems to pursue the good craftsmanship in this total waste that doesn't care about family. Okay, interesting. Um, I cannot pronounce most of these, so I won't bother. So, um, that's one. Uh, relationships, he is... Has a kindled spirit, close friend, kindled spirit, close friend. Do he have enemies? Passing acquaintance. Let's go to the second one. Like I said, we're going to be doing twice. So, Game King 1. Labors. He has a real sense of empathy. He's, he greatly feels for the surrounding space. He has very good feelings for social relationships and good intellect. And a feel for music. But he has a little difficulty with words and bad intuition. Yeah, I don't know what that is. Let me know in the comment section what it is. I want to look everything up. He relies on the, on the advice of others during decision making. He has little time for forgiveness and will generally seek retribution. Oh, you stab him in the back and he will shovel a pickaxe in your face. Something like that. 
He often feels uh, envious of others. He makes somewhat uncomfortable... Um, he is somewhat uncomfortable around others that appear unusual or lie, lie, or live differently from himself. He tends to be passive in discussions. He doesn't seek out excitement. He doesn't cling ten tightly to ideas and is open to changing his mind. He does not easily fall in love and rarely develops positive sentiments. He is troubled by this because he values romance. Oh my god. He inhales sharply when he's angry. He's currently more rude. He's currently more fearless. He's currently more conf uh, confident. He's currently more shameless. He is currently less private. Okay. He needs alcohol to go through that. It's a typical dwarf. It is a typical dwarf. Um, values. Uh, likes others in his culture. Holds craftsmanship of high regards. Sentiment of, okay, so Artem is a masterwork. Great deal of respect for the law. So it's basically somewhat the same as the other. He personally thinks romance is very important in life. He believes it is important to conceal emotions and refrain from complaining. Values decorum. 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 I think it's that, is that like statues? Dignity and proper behavior and doesn't think. Okay, so he wants the master escape. Doesn't think uh, one way or the other about leisure time. Okay, so I didn't want to cut the sentence short there. That just uh, sounded weird. Can't pronounce that neat. Let's take a look at his relations. So he doesn't have a deity, or, or Della is his deity, one or the other. Uh, close friend, close friend, close friend. He has a lot of friends. He's not pissed at anyone, so that's, that's, that's good, that's good. So I hope you like that, I'm doing two. Um, that means that we will run out of names. Let's take a look here. Uh, two, that's second, that's three. Uh, three, four, five, five. In the sixth episode, so this is going to be then one about two dwarves, <laughs> and then the next time it is uh, two more. So it's six more episodes. So if you want to have a named dwarf, by all means, go for it. it. It's not too much difficulty for me to actually add names. So, oh wait, he's making coke. You don't need. We have a good good amount of coke actually. Well, actually, mm, you do you, mate. You do you. Okay. Um. Oh, we need to get started with this. And we'll do this one as well, so we can actually start the wall off here. Okay. Right. Wall. Uh, I want to select the material. So, it has to be like over here. We have only 27 of those cheaper materials. No X's. Of course not. Yeah, I was being a bit silly here. Construction wall. There we go. And... Uh, one, two, three. Don't do that. This one. And just go up here. That should be enough. Can we use something else? Well, we can use some of this and that as well. So that should. If this fails, guys, my god, this is going to be. That's going to be something. <laughs> it's not going to be pretty, I can tell you that. We need to also place walls in here. And then we will do a ramp over here. Which they probably won't have the easiest time to get. So we'll make a bridge across here. 
and it will land over here and it will have access we do another wall uh, i'm not sure yet let's pause it for a second what's going on uh we have the cheese we have a sandstone cabinet masterwork winter has grown cancel temp located you have struck okay that's not too important that's fine that's fine uh let this be for whatever it is let's go down again yeah we still didn't do the staircases over here this looks like it's starting to be okay i want to remove these i don't know if i actually allowed it to be here uh but if i did then i don't want them there anymore we have a good amount of seats they so far i've only seen them like stand okay that looks okay this is fine the bedrooms let's let's finish those up um furniture beds you oh, okay do we not have wood anymore i think we don't have wood anymore also you can go and take that i don't know why that's lying over there uh, let's just cut those down. Oh, uh, what's going on over here? The tavern keeper has been found dead? What the hell were you doing over there? Oh no. Oh, I know. Um. Forbid. Oh, you simple fool. What are you doing here? No, no, you as well. He's going to get his ass kicked. He's injured. He's overexerted. Oh, yeah, they're going to kill him. Yep. He, there's no way I can save him. What are you doing? That's just stupid. Uh, is he still alive? Oh, no. What are you doing? What are you doing here, buddy? Get the hell out of there. Some people are angry. Why are you angry? Because people are dying, I think. Uh, this is spiraling out of control. Yeah, no, I, I bet you're pissed. Oh, no. We need to um, create a few tombs. Why are you pissed? Yeah, he's sad because someone died. But you will be sadder in a second. Damn. Okay, we need a place of memorial. Could do that over here. But I think we will do that. We'll just do the designing right now. And we'll, uh, we'll cut it out next time. So, we'll keep the same thing going like we've done. And... I want to give them nice rooms. I don't know how many we will get, actually. So maybe we should do coffin door. We'll make those into tombs. Oh, man, this is going to be sinister. Door, coffin... Let's wait here. Let's see. Needs to be a hallway in here. <sighs> I feel bad for these guys. Actually, if we um, see, that's one. That's that's one, two. No, it doesn't matter how we do it. It's just fine. Uh, we'll just prepare for the um, the imminent future. There will be more casualties, of course. This uh, is it is a dwarf society after all. Oh man, yeah, we'll do something like this. Actually, we got some time here, and we do mine pretty pretty fast. That means that we need to start making coffins. Oh, man. 
that's a coffin, this is a coffer. Let's not put them in coffers. Let's put them in coffer, uh, coffins. Uh, we do have enough doors for this. Let them start mining that out. How is this going? Uh, we should have more furniture, no? Oh, seriously, one, huh? That's not, that's not a lot. Furniture chest. Because it's rock chest. That one's placed wrong. Let's cancel that one. So that is all done. Could you please make two more beds? No beds. Uh, become a woodworker? Yeah, yeah, I think we have another position of that. Tavern keeper found dead. Uh, I'm really bummed out about that. <sighs> oh well, what can you do about it, huh? Let's make more bedrooms. Yeah, that's just, that's just, it's sad. It, it really is sad. We should actually do something about that. Okay, how is things going over here? See, I don't think there's an aquifer over here. Well, maybe, maybe that is the final position, but we could start mining this out as well. Uh, no, we'll go down one more. Just better save than sorry, I guess. And we'll um, absolutely demolish. Yeah. Who else is there? Oh, Azir was already fighting there. Man, I need I need guards. I really need guards. We need this to be dull with. Okay, that is what we'll do next time, guys. Next time is we are going to be continuing work. Oh, is this blocked? I think it's blocked. Oh well, well, eventually... We'll see what happens over here. Um, I'm thinking we'll, uh, this will eventually just be dug out anyways. We'll bypass this entire area. They can just fall down to their death and drown uh, with our farms. Stonecraft is fighting. He's still fighting. He's going at it like there is no stopping the guy. Coffins have been made. This has been done. Let's just finish this. Let's go doors. Uh, one, two, three, four. And then... Uh, that, that should be enough. And... Is it furniture coffin? Burial. That means we would have to get his corpse. That is a problem. That honestly is a problem. Yeah. We can't do this until we have the militia. Okay, let's think about where we want the militia. <clears throat> I'm thinking over here. We will create a barracks next time. Get a few people into the militia. Have them train, equip gear. And then have combat with those damn... Damn animals. And it's winter now, so they actually are trying to get the hell away from here, I guess. There's a lot of dingo corpses over here. Oh yeah, there's, there's a corpse. And we could start picking this. Yeah, we will annihilate these guys for sure. Anyways, thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to uh, like the video if you are interested in this. And this will have to go. I'm very, very sorry. We can't have that. It looks hideous. Sorry, can't do that. Anyways, have a good one. Bye-bye.